guys and welcome back to Divinity Original Sin. Let us continue our journey. Let's a quick look at the uh, journal, see where we're up to. We found some legionnaires, already as mentioned, they're already dead, we'll need to keep looking for the survivors, okay. Murder. Nothing left in here to take, I don't think. Oh, let's head back outside. Who's that? Okay, let's have a look at these. Greetings. Hmm. One of them's telling the truth, and one of them's trying to dress it up like they're uh, they're not scared. Do we come by? No. It appears these two are the last ones alive. <laughs> so they wanted to check out the lighthouse in the name of their comrades in arms. Bye. Okay. Get debate. We met two legionnaires, Lucia and Malleus. They were part of the expedition sent by Captain Aureus, but they are the last survivors. We wanted to investigate the lighthouse so we can report whatever we find. Okay. Yes, well, give me a moment. I'm just let my settle. I think it's pretty cool. Look how wet the characters look. How he's with the rain coming down. Cool. Is there anything behind there? Ooh, auto save, that's never a good thing. The further we go, the more bodies we find heaped around. We must be closing in on where they were headed. Slightly better than what we're wearing. And he needs all the, all the armor he can get, so we'll equip those. Send those two jewels. Send them to Jahan. <laughs> Send him to Bard. He's all the same. Alright, we can sell those. Send to Aubrey. Uh, that's not good. Send to Aubrey. Whoops. She doesn't need money. Send to Aubrey. Type. Right. Oops. Wrong one. Here we go. What level four? What level are we now? Three. Ew. And there's our first mini boss. The ghoul that guards the lighthouse, level five. Yuck. Oh, well, we're, ne we're nearly level five. We might ding up a couple of these, actually. Uh... I'll tell you what. 
to initiate combat. Yes. <laughs> Oop, he's on the move. Spider up, definitely. We will need his help. Uh, need you to move forward into a line of sight. There. Front, get ready to do some tanking. And we haven't got a pet on him yet, that's not very good. Anything we can see? No. So you can move up a little bit. Go on, doggy. Two archers, right, we need to deal with them. Ooh, yes. Ooh, stay there. that do? Decrease the willpower and body will it? I'll tell you what, we'll attack instead. Dink. Dink. Oh shit! Damn it! Not what I meant to do. <laughs> Damn it! Level up. Constitution. Yes. Available one. That for the time being. Uh, 
you will have a look. I should have done it before I attacked, shouldn't I? Really? Oh dear. Dexterity. Take that up. Give me some scoundrel skills. Yes, I will. Give me some scoundrel skills. Alright, okay. That's you done. That one's dead. Damage on you. not teleport you. Let's uh, stun you. Stunning fail. Great. Blind fail. Spidey. Yes, I know he keeps bringing them back, but what can you do? Something new, Spidey. But it's extra experience for me if he keeps bringing them back. Uh, you can move your one pace. Go on, Spidey, do your stuff. Damn it.
sort all this out and we're going to focus on the boss. Nearly there. Come on, Spidey, finish it off. Nice warm. There's the first mini boss done then. Right, let's just get some healing on the go here. Do your hands. Upgrade. Intelligence on Jahan, I think, yes. He's got Erythurge and Hydra, that's a bit shit. Um, not quite sure what level you'll get the He's got the craft resume. Alright, we'll leave that for the moment. Is uh, his point? Let's finish the ceiling. And what have we got to pick up? Stardust. Oh. What an invigorating fight that was, and what a killing blow you delivered. Yes, I. Since it was the spider that did it, though, I'm not sure I can take, take the blame for that. Cheers, yes, I'm almost like the best of the best, even to say so myself. <laughs> Oh uh, dear, okay. Oh, there, I wouldn't go that far, especially not standing in the blast radius of your soon to burst vanity bubble. Let's have that, eh? <laughs> right, uh, I'll go on then, we'll pick all this up. At some point, we can send it back to the The homestead, whatever they call it. So there's some good stuff in this. Clubbering time. Check this. And check this. Take all. Mm. 
And which one of my has geomancing? No. Jules. I think I've gone too far on Jules there. How many, how many skills has she got? One, two, three. Oh, she's only got three. That's all right. So we need to give uh, Jahan another one. Now, should I give him witchcraft or should I give him geomancer? Or maybe pyro. Uh, think about it. Can't make the decision yet. Right, let's look at this stuff. I can go to the ranger, ranger, read. Already got it. Jules, Jules, Jules. Oh, it's better armor, but we'll lose armor specialist. Hmm. No, leave that. Send it to Jules. Send it to Jules. One hander, 40 to 54 strength. Oh, yes, we'll have some of that. Plus one on action points with it being a level higher, but look at the damage on that. Wow. And it's unbreakable. So those jewels. Mm. Yeah, it's better than what she's wearing, so she might as well wear it. Still don't know what that does. Two alone, Master. What's that one? Dexterity seven. That's the Ranger. Ooh, yes, that's much better. Equip that. Intelligence plus one for a Ranger. Why would I do that? Mm. I suppose we can keep that and give that to. Uh, Wargraf in uh, the new homestead thing. Oh yeah, it's better than what she's wearing. We'll equip that. Send that to all grey. Right, let's just head into the lighthouse. Samson. Can I help you? What's this? Living eyes that can see the shape of death? Avert your gaze, wanderer, for you are looking upon the phantom of a murderer. Tell me about yourself. Samson was my name a long time ago. I know not why upon my death I became a ghost doomed to haunt this tower. Perhaps the gods heard of my crime and stripped me of my rightful place in their eternal realm. If so, their punishment was just. Each night I wake, would wake the flame in the lighthouse to repent for my wretched sin. You call yourself a murderer? Why? That indeed is the tainted title I must bear, and deservedly so. For fifteen years ago to the day, it was that I sat atop my lighthouse, the flame unlit, and watched on as a pitiable ship crashed upon the cliff and got devoured by greedy waves. 
Deliberately, I had forgone to do my duty. Willfully did I condemn every soul aboard to a salty sleep on the bed of an indifferent sea. Why did you do it? Why did I commit this act of blackest horror? Jealousy, anger, the bitter anguish of a broken heart. Those are the ancient ills that drove me to madness. Desdemona was on board, as I knew she would be, my wife. The delicate beauty of whom I was sure she was betraying me with her friend, the dashing Faladar. Possessed as I was by the demons of envy, ire and torment, I decided that if I had to, had her love no longer, only death could take her from, for her mistress. So I sat here, coldly and calmly, as I delivered them both unto the deep. Yet no sooner had the water closed its spurming, spume, what's that? spuming jaws around the perishing vessel below that the extent of my offence dawned on my beleaguered mind. Overcome with guilt, I sought escape through the hangman's noose, but rest was not to come. I heard there might be undead lair here. Do you know anything about that? Skeletons roam the lands, restless is my troubled soul, but you don't find their lair here. Some scuttle by now and again, but most of the time I reside here in solitude. Solitude and silence. I'll take my land. Farewell! Oh dear. Sad tale. But he's got a chest. No, let's rob him. <laughs> take that. Oh. And Jules wants to speak. Quite a story that ghost had to tell. Not every day one hears about a lighthouse keeper sinking ships just because his wife proved to be unfaithful. Choices. A uh, pitiful creature, a contemptible man. Um, aye, a pitiful creature torn up so badly by the loss of a love that it led him to commit murder. I almost feel sorry for him. Yes, I understand, despite his heinous act, one can't commiserate with his plight. Nothing more bitter than love undone. Very true. And we're forgiving for that. I see your eyes before me still. What else we've got down here? Chest. The cold white sea. And I, the maniac in the darkened lighthouse. Oh, folly. Oh, your potion plus. Could your hand can use those? Two hander. Keep just in case, eh? Boulder bash. What, what, what? What's that? Ruby. Well spotted. I'll save it there. Well, there we have it, guys. We've uh, done our first mini boss. We've updated the journal. The Scaredy Pact. Uh, we found our way inside the lighters and met a ghost named Samson, tortured soul indeed, but he seems to have nothing to do with the underground break. We've also got the lost love of the lighthouse. So I take it we're looking now for Desdemonia. Desdemona. And before we finish, we will just head back to the two legionnaires and uh, finish up the Scaredy Pact quest. I'll get, it, get an update on it at least. Because there's a chest behind them, I think. Yes, there is. Back again. How did it go? Don't spare any details. We need to make a full report to the captain. Ah, that's an interesting story. Clean the grit from your ears and I'll tell you all about it. Indeed. Now there's a story worth of an audience. So let me get this straight. There's a ghost inside operating a lighthouse. He managed to do away with the bad beasties at the base of the thing. Sounds like a job well done. I'm sure Aureus will be thrilled to hear we did it. Another <laughs> triumph for the Legion daring do. <laughs> if this doesn't buy us a ticket home, nothing will. Bye. There they go. And we need another conversation. 
I need a moment to reflect. For the good of all source hunters, it ought to be the altruist week as I thought an exception. It does feel quite good to move oneself to those in need. I've grown increasingly selfless, but wonder if I've gone too far. What sort of source hunter is as soft heart as I've become is absurd. Um, you've quite trended towards altruism, haven't you? Oh, okay. That wasn't a very interesting answer, was it? Well, how can it be locked? Alright then. We shall smash you open. Have at the chest. And the beauty is that that weapon is unbreakable. So we'll have to repair it. Yeehaw. That resurrect school always comes in handy. Send those the jewels for identifying. Lord Master One, right well she needs that. Then we can identify that stuff up there. Equip. Send that to Old Grey. Hmm. So it's at your hands if you need them. And I should be able to do these now. Send that to Ranger. Blacksmithing. Jahan. We're starting to do quite well here, guys. Jahan. Equip. Abilities. Yep, yeah, blacksmithing at two. Those have got resistance, so we can have those. Those can go to all grey. 16 armour, but we'll lose bodybuilding. No. So it to all grey. Wait till we get something with some decent stats on it. And why does... Jewels need healing. Right, so there we go, guys. We'll call it there for this episode. Thanks very much for watching. Don't forget, if you do like the videos, please like, leave me a like and subscribe. This is All Grey, signing off.